Well, up until, say, the end of 2009, so not that long ago, we didn't know whether or not diet quality was linked at all to depression and anxiety. They're called the common mental disorders. So other areas of medicine have known for a long time that the quality of your diet is really important for you know, cardiovascular disease and cancer and diabetes and all those sorts of things. But we hadn't had the same knowledge in psychiatry. But since the end of 2009, there's been a lot of studies done looking at the relationship between the quality of your overall diet and your risk for depression and anxiety, the common mental disorders, and showing pretty unequivocally that the two are related. So if you have a diet that's usually you know, pretty healthy and high in fruits and vegetables and lean red meats and fish and that sort of thing, you're at reduced risk for depression and anxiety, according to some of the studies. Um, and on the other hand, if you have a diet that's got a lot of junk and processed foods, high saturated fat and refined sugars, that seems to increase your risk. And we've seen these uh, sorts of relationships now in studies from right around the world. So here in Australia, um, Norway, the United States, China, Japan, Taiwan, uh, France, you know, all these different European countries. And really importantly, we've seen it in adolescents and children as well. Um, and given that the, the main age of onset for these common mental disorders is childhood and early adolescence, um, we are now really coming to the conclusion that you know the quality of the diet that kids are eating is particularly important.